Hi my lovelies, welcome back to my channel Ember's Lifestyle and welcome to today's video. So coming up today, I have three hauls to share with you. So um, they wasn't enough to do individual hauls, so I've put three together to make up today's video. I've got a haul from B&M, a haul from Home Bargains and also a haul from Poundland. So that is coming up later on in today's video. But before we get into the hauls, how are you all? I hope you are all well and having a good weekend. Um, I'm getting there, I think. Um, I think I mentioned on my last video um, that, yeah, I've been suffering with my asthma and a bit of a chest infection. So I've been on antibiotics and steroids. So I've not been feeling too great, not been having too much energy, really. And I've got so much to do to get ready for the holiday. Um, so, yeah, I've been uh, getting a bit stressed out about everything I've got to do. Um, but hopefully I'm getting uh, getting through it now and um, yeah, I'm still not brilliant, I have to say. I've only got one day of antibiotics and steroids left, so yeah, I'm not quite sure whether I'm going to have to go back to the doctors or not. But fingers crossed I'm going to get it sorted. Um, what else have I been up to? Yeah, just the same old, same old, same old really. Getting stuff ready for the holiday, trying to get up to date with some vlogs and um, yeah, just all usual, you know, life. <laughs> jobs, housework, you know, nothing very exciting, I don't think. Um, looking forward to tomorrow, going out um, for a bottomless brunch um, with uh, a friend tomorrow. So looking forward to doing that as a late birthday treat for her and an early birthday treat for me. So looking forward to going there tomorrow. So that'll be nice. Um, but yeah, other than that, I don't really think I've got that much to catch you up on. Um, but I hope you're all well and um, yeah, let's get on with the hauls. So we have just got back from B&M. So I'm just going to share with you what we got. Some of it's not very exciting, but I'll just share everything with you. So we got some Colgate Total Toothpaste. That was £1.75. We bought three chocolate oranges uh, because it was only one pound. I think you get a lot of chocolate in them for a pound and everything seems to be going up, but these have stopped at a pound. I noticed quite a lot of the chocolate's gone up. The bags of buttons used to be a pound. They're one twenty-five. Boxes of Maltesers used to be a pound and they were one twenty-five. So lots of price increases on stuff, but these were still one pound each. So I got one for me, one for Harvey, one for Kaya. Richard didn't want one. The Cathedral City mini blocks have changed the packaging um, and these have also gone up. These are now £1.40. Then I got three lots of the hay fever and allergy relief um, tablets, the loratadine ones. I got three packs of those, stocked upon those. You get 14 tablets in each of those packs and they were 79 pence. Just got a litre of semi-skim milk, <coughs> excuse me, 99 pence. Richard treated himself to a bottle of Peroni. Um, I think that was 2 29 Then got some vegetable oil. That was £2 something, I think. Then tomato puree. I think that was like, I don't know, 80p. Does that sound about right? Let me just lean over and get my receipt. Peroni, 2 29 uh, The vegetable oil was 2 39 And the... Um, let me have a look where, what am I looking for? Tomato puree, uh, that was 89p. And then we've got the Skinny Crunch cereal. Absolutely love this one. I've spoken about it before on my channel. I highly recommend the Berry Granola one. They also do a chocolate one, but I'm not so keen on that. This is two pounds in B&M, 111 calories per portion. Love that. I got some Imperial uh, Leather Shower Gel, the Pink Lychee and Raspberry Let's Flamingo one. That was £1. I got a Nivea Soft Rose Lip Balm. That was £1. Got some Pilar Rice because Kaya is cooking her chicken curry uh, for tea tonight. So I've got some Pilar Rice to go with it. I've already got one uh, sachet of this from um, Aldi, but I wanted another one. So I got this from B&M. Yeah, Kai makes a lovely chicken curry, bless her. So uh, she's going to do that for tea tonight. The pilaf rice from B&M was 69 pence. Then we got some Lynx um, body wash. Um, this was 95 pence. Then my daughter loves this So Body Spray or Body Mist. You get 200 mil in there. 
This is the Santorini Sunset. She's already got one of the others. I can't remember what it's called. Uh, but she loves this so stuff. So the Santorini Sunset. Let me just check my receipt for that because I'm not sure. $2.99 that was. Then, same as I say, Kaya loves to do some baking and cooking. Uh, so does Harvey, actually. Both my son and my daughter liked him. Uh, so my daughter fancied uh, making this up uh, one day. So she bought this box of Cadbury Squidgy Chocolate Cookie, cookie Mix. It makes 10 um, and it's Cadbury, so it should be nice. I don't think she's ever done this one before. She's done the cake uh, that's in her box, the Cadbury cake, but the cookie mix I don't think we've had before. That was £2. Then I bought this duster for my son to take away so he can dust his bedroom. Um, when he goes away to drama school in Essex in September. It's the Addis Handhold Noodle Duster. It's got a machine washable head. It was 2 99 and yeah, it does feel quite sturdy. Um, so yeah, pick that up. And then the last thing, the best uh, bargain of the day, uh, we picked up this Modern One Draw Bedside Table. It says £30, but it was actually reduced to £20. We got it in white, but it's also available in grey. There's the dimensions, 38 by 38 by height, 60 centimetres, if anybody's interested in the size. That's what it looks like. So it's a little round one with the drawer and with three legs, available in grey as well, like I say. And that is for Harvey to take to drama school as well, uh, because the room is staying in. It's got wardrobe and drawers and bed, but it hasn't got a bedside table and he likes it to put a lamp on it. Uh, he likes a bedside table so he can put a lamp on it. Um, so, yeah, so we picked that up for £20. So that is everything we got in B&M today. So we have just got back from Home Bargains. I just can't keep away from that shop at the moment. I'm just forever in there picking stuff up. Um, but yeah, so I've got quite a few bits to share with you all. So I thought I would pop on and show you what I got today. So I got two packs of the Big D Salted Peanuts. My husband Richard loves these and they're only 29 pence each. I picked up a bar of the Milka Confetti. This is for me. I had it a few weeks ago um, for the first time and I really liked it. I'm trying not to eat loads of chocolate, but I am an absolute chocoholic, so I have to have some. <laughs> um, but I think this one, it isn't like massive. Not in comparison with what I could eat. It's just 100 grams and that was 79 pence. Then I got 20 of the Thai Handle Swing Bin Liners Lemon Fragrance. They were 99 pence, I think. Then I got 15 metres of the Extra Thick um, Kitchen Foil, the Extra Long One. Let me just reach back and get my receipt because I can't quite remember how much that was. I suppose it was like 99 pence or something. Um, yeah, 99 pence. Then I got some of the Fly and Wasp spray, and that was 199. Then moving on to the freezer bits, I just got two uh, bits from the freezer section. I got a pack of the Good Fellas Pizza Pockets. They only uh, take two minutes in the microwave, and they come in pepperoni or cheese and tomato cheese and tomato and they are £1.50. Then I got a two pack of the Chicago Town Pizza Subs, the cheese and tomato ones. And they were only, I think they were like £1.9p or £1.5p, something like that, £1.9. Then I got one of the Garnier uh, uh, Micellar Cleansing Water. It's one of the little ones because I thought this would be ideal to take away on holiday. And me and my daughter both like this micellar cleansing water. So picked that up for holes. That was only 99 pence. Then my son has the Neutrogena T-Gel Therapeutic Shampoo. I always get that from Home Bargains. It's the cheapest place I've found it. It's £4.29. Obviously, it's quite expensive, uh, but it is really good. It tends to have um, a bit of a, a dry scalp, flaky scalp. Um, so we find that is absolutely fantastic. Um, so yeah, he likes to use that 125ml in there. My daughter likes this simple shampoo. 
So I picked her up one of those. She also has the simple conditioner and I tend to get them both from Home Bargains. They're only 99 pence each. So I picked her up one of those. Then I've picked up a shampoo and conditioner. Again, this is to put away for the holiday. Um, I picked the, I don't know, I didn't know which to have. There were so many different sorts in Pantene and in other makes as well. But I picked this one. I think I have had these before. They are the Pantene Repair and Protect. So I picked up the shampoo and the conditioner. This one says the shampoo Keratin Reconstruct. And it says visibly healthier hair in one use. And the conditioner says for weak damaged hair. So I just thought they sounded good with being repair and protect for on holiday in the sun when your hair's getting a bit frazzled. Um, so yeah, picked up those and they were 1.99 each, I think. Um, and you get 360 ml in those. So the big-ish bottles, I suppose. Then I picked up this. This was in the camping section. It's not for us to go camping, but that's where it was in Home Bargains. It's for my son to take, for when he moves away to Essex, for him to take his lunch to college. Um, it's the Lakescape Cutlery Set. It's a stainless steel knife with bottle opener, fork and spoon, easy to clip together. So I just thought they were ideal for taking with his lunchbox uh, because he doesn't really like sandwiches that much. So he's thinking of taking probably pasta and things like that um, to college for lunch. So he'll need some cutlery to eat it with. So yeah, picked up those. And I think they were £1.29, something like that. But actually, if anybody's into camping, they've got loads of camping stuff in Home Bargains. And the camping cutlery, three in one set, was £1.29. Then, last down to the last few bits. Let's start off with this first. This is a H2O fan. It's a battery-operated water mist spray fan. Requires two AA batteries, which aren't included. This was only one ninety nine. It came in this sort of turquoise blue colour, a dark blue colour, and also a bright pink. It says lightweight and portable trigger spray lever, soft Eva blades. I thought this was ideal for taking on holiday. It's going to be red hot, especially in Las Vegas when we go. Um, San Francisco uh, shouldn't be as hot. Los Angeles will be a bit warmer still. And then Las Vegas uh, will be red hot. So I thought this was just ideal to carry around with us when we're out and about to spray ourselves with water and also the fan. Might go back and get another one because obviously I've only picked up one between the four of us. Um, so I'll see, might go back. But for one ninety nine to either take away on holiday or just when you're in the garden or even in the house when it's red hot, obviously, but just spray water them. Um, yeah, I, th I just thought a fab price for one ninety nine. Then I picked up a pack of the Hollywood Browser. I think these are absolutely fantastic. I've got some at the minute. Uh, one of them's gone a bit blunt and I've started on the other one. So I thought while I see them in Home Bargains, because they can be a lot more expensive than they are in Home Bargains, I thought I'm going to pick, um, pick some up. They had some in a single set, but I picked up this uh, pack of two. Uh, 2 99 that's all they were in Home Bargains. I'm sure you know what the Hollywood browsers are, but if you don't, they are the hair removal and dermaplaning tool and they remove peach fuzz. So they remove hair and exfoliate and I find them really do work. I find them fab and for that price, 2 99 for a pack of term, you get two browsers and one protective pouch in there. So yeah, I think they are fab. Then next, I got this BB cream daily all in one blen blemish balm in medium with vitamin E and mineral pigments. It says it evens skin tone and it blurs imperfections, smooths, smooths fine lines, and hydrates the skin. Now, I've heard good things about this. I don't know about it myself, I don't think I've ever used it myself, but I have heard it's good. So I thought I'm going to pick myself some up. It was two ninety nine, and I just thought, yeah, I'm going to buy some because I just think it will be ideal for taking on holiday. Uh, because let me just check. I'm just checking. It was two ninety nine. Um, I think it was. Uh, where is it? 
Oh, I can't find it. I'm going to see. It's always a way, isn't it, when you want to look for something. Oh, no, it was one ninety nine. It was only one ninety nine. So even better. Um, I just thought this was ideal for taking away on holiday. I don't like wearing foundation when it's really hot. So I thought this, uh, with it being um, uh, a BB cream and having a bit of colour to it, I thought I would take that instead. So I'm going to give that a whirl. So if any of you have, have used it, I'd love to hear your thoughts on that. The same with this next thing. Never had it before, but I know it's a lot more expensive than this. I've seen it on Instagram, people raving about it. I haven't used it myself, but they are selling it at the minute in home bargains. And I know it's usually a lot more money and they are selling in home bargains for $1.99. It is the Wonder Kiss Lip Plumping Gloss. It says uh, your must have accessory for perfectly plumped lips. It's not got a colour to it, it is just plain gloss. It's in a big box, but I don't really know why, because it's just there in down the side of it. So for one ninety nine, same as I say, I know it can be a lot more money than that, so I am going to give that a whirl, because I do like gloss, and if it plumps your lips up, even if only a little bit, I'm not expecting it to work, you know, massively, but... If it just gives them a little bit of a plum, I'll be happy with that. So hopefully that is good. So I'm really pleased with a few of the items I've got today. Um, yeah, I'm really pleased with the fan and the BB cream and the uh, Wonder Kiss lip plumping gloss. Oh, I nearly forgot. I bought this. It's standing up at the side of the kitchen here. This was 19 99 and as you can see, it is this artificial rose uh, leaf trellis. So it's got a trellis on the back, so it expands. And let me just tell you the sizes. So it's called Artificial Rose Trellis, UV protected, expandable willow fence. The expanded size is height 1.8 metres by the width 0.9 metres. Same as I say, this was 19.99. They also had uh, very similar to this, but it was slightly bigger, and it was also 19.99, but it didn't have the flowers on. So if you're not keen on the flowers, but you want this leaf background, they also do that. It, this is very similar to the one that I've got on the back garden on my fence. This is actually for up the side fence at the front. Um, I got my other ones from B&M, but I couldn't find, couldn't find any this year in there. So I got, saw this in Home Bargains and I thought I'm getting it. So I'm really pleased with that as well for £20. So yeah, that is everything that I got from Home Bargains today. So we have just got back from Poundland. So I got a few bits, so I thought it was worth just uh, quickly popping on and showing you. So the first thing are the um, oval, 100 oval cotton pads. They were one pound. Then the pack of the three um, shower scrunches. They were one pound. Couldn't go to Poundland without getting a bar of the Twin Peaks. If you know, you know, love it, one pound. Um, my son wanted the super noodles, bachelor's super noodles, barbecue beef. They are 75 pence each from Poundland. My daughter chose the Haribo Tang Fast Sticks, one pound. And my son chose the Haribo Ballast Sticks, strawberry flavour for one pound. Naxter's Big Stack, and that was one pound fifty. So yeah, just like a, a double burger. And then my son wanted a few stationary bits, so um, he bought the pack of uh, Neon Sharpies, so you get four in there, and I think they were £2 for that one. Um, let me just check. Uh, let me just try and find it on the receipt. Sharpie Neon, four pack, £2.50. Then the individual Sharpie Ultra Fine, that one there, that was £1. And then the um, student set, you've got two pencils in there, rubber, um, pencil sharpener, ruler and pen. Let me just check the price of that one. That was £2. So that is everything we got from Poundland today. So that is it for today's video. I really hope you have enjoyed watching. Um, I've got lots of new videos lined up coming up to you over the next few weeks. I've got a massive Primark haul, a really big one. I've also got another charity shop haul coming up. I've got a Poundland um, collab Best Buys coming up. 
um, a home sense come shop coming up as well. Um, yeah, and a few other things in the pipeline as well. So yeah, got lots of um, hauls and videos coming up over the next few weeks. Obviously, when we get back up off from our holiday, I will also have travel vlogs going up. So I will be filming in San Francisco, Los Angeles and Las Vegas. So I'll have a few travel vlogs coming up as well. Going to show you um, around everything that we are going to be doing in those three places. We have got um, lots of things booked. Um, so yeah, loads of things to vlog. Um, in San Francisco, um, we are going to Alcatraz, so I can vlog that. Um, we're going to go to Pier 39, um, Golden Gate Bridge. In Los Angeles, we're going on a uh, celebrity house tour. We're going to Disneyland. We're going to Universal. Um, we're going to Ch the Chinese Theatre. We're going to Griffith Observatory. Um, we are, what else? What else have we got booked? Uh, some more things, I think, for Los Angeles. I can't remember. <laughs> and then Las Vegas. Um, oh, we're booked to go and see um, the Hoover Dam and the Grand Canyon. And we want to go on a gondola ride um, at the Venetian Hotel. Um, we want to go on the High Roller, which is a bit like the London Eye. We want to go on the Slotzilla ride, which is like a zip wire. Um, yeah, so loads and loads of things coming up in the travel vlogs. Really, really excited about that. Um, it's my special birthday. That's why we are having a special holiday this year. I'm 50 at the end of uh, this month. So, um, yeah, that's why we're going all out on the holiday this year. And also, that's one of the reasons. And also, I just think life's too short. And yeah, as a lot of us know, life's too short. And um, yeah, I just think, yeah, you've got to try and do these things while you are relatively fit and healthy. And also, obviously, with Harvey going away as well in September, we wanted to make a big, nice family holiday for the four of us before he moves away as well. So, yeah, so lots of videos anyway coming up. So that's it. I'll see you all in the next one. Take care of yourselves. Bye.